Testing demand in Waterbury isn't slowing down as we get closer to the end of 2021. The city also seeing the virus spread faster as the Omicron variant becomes more prevalent. Channel 3 Waterbury Bureau Chief Dennis Valera shows us some of the latest efforts by city leaders to control the virus. In an effort to create a new mass COVID testing site for Waterbury, city leaders got together to create this site at Municipal Stadium just for the day. It's part of the overall strategy to get this virus under control amid rising numbers. This new site started up at 7 this morning, running until supply ran out. Now the city is trying to establish a new permanent testing site given the heightened demand at the Brass Mill Center Mall. Like much of the state, the city continues to see higher case numbers, often seeing daily increases in the triple digits. But like when we first started seeing the increase in cases, there's also been more getting vaccinated. We are definitely seeing like good turnout at the vaccination site we have at 910 Walcott. We have lots of people coming in for their boosters downstairs. We have a lot of people bringing their little ones in for that, you know, the 5 to 11 year olds who are eligible now for their first doses. The city's vaccination clinic next to the Walmart as well as the testing site at the mall will be closed New Year's Eve and New Year's Day. They will be back open on Sunday. Now later at 530, we'll take a closer look at what's driving up the case numbers here. Here in Waterbury, Dennis Valera, Channel 3, Heaven's News.